Hey, what's going on, y'all? Hope y'all are great. So today I just want to talk about some marketing and advertising gems for y'all. Um, so what's on my mind today is just marketing and advertising is non-negotiable. It's non-negotiable. Uh, I've been talking to a lot of folks and, you know, they always say like, well, how much should I spend on my ads, on my marketing? What's my budget? Is it 500, 1,000? Is it 5,000? Is it 10,000? Um, the main thing is you need to spend something. <laughs> you need to spend something uh, because the fact that a lot of entrepreneurs think that they don't have to spend money on marketing or advertising just kind of baffles me. Um, look at a company like Nike. They have 97% market share or whatever. It's something crazy high like that. I don't know if that's spe the specific number, but I know it's very high in shoes uh, in that uh, market share in that industry. And do they still spend money on ads and marketing? Yes, I believe they do. A company like McDonald's has whatever market share of fast food, restaurants, McDonald's all over the world. You can go to any country. And do they do they still like spend money on marketing and advertising their product and their business? <laughs> yes, they do. So what makes us think as entrepreneurs, as solopreneurs, as whatever small businesses <laughs> that we don't have to? So we definitely have to. Um, this is not to demean anyone. It's just to encourage everyone to know, you know, if you're not where you are, uh, not where you want to be in your business, uh, it may be because you're not actually putting the money uh, or advertising dollars and marketing dollars to meet the goals that you say you want to hit. So I was talking to someone recently the other day and I, you know, they were like, oh, I want to hit over six figures this year. And it's like, you know, all right, well, you want to hit over six figures. And what's interesting is a lot of people, they'll share numbers. Like I do 10K a month, I do 20K a month, I do 100K a month, you know, but I'm always asking, okay, what did it cost you to actually make that? <laughs> you know, so like I can tell you, you know, what it cost me when I had my first 10K month, what it cost me to get 10K. When I had my first 20K month, like how much did I spend to get to 20K? Talking about my payroll, my advertising budget, all the softwares that we subscribe to, all the coaches that I pay thousands of dollars a month to learn from to be able to actually, number one, mentally be able to get there in the business and then actually to have people that I can hire to help me get to those uh, numbers that I wanted to get to at one point. Um, so I just think that's, you know, something that definitely people need to think about um, and just put, you know, something to the side, you know, put definitely make sure you have a marketing advertising budget. You don't got to start with ten thousand dollars a month spending on marketing, but start with something, you know, maybe five hundred or maybe a thousand. Um, but don't go into it just thinking, oh, I'm going to spend one hundred dollars a month and I'm going to make 10K a month. Uh, that's just not realistic. So I hope this is helpful. Just make sure that, you know, marketing and advertising is non-negotiable. If you truly believe in your product or service, you have a moral obligation to sell it. So go out there and sell. Selling is not bad. I know there's a stigma behind it sometimes, but it's not bad at all. Like I said, if you truly believe in your product or service, you have a moral obligation to sell it. And we're really not even salespeople. We're not marketing people. We're not even entrepreneurs. We're not business owners. We are problem solvers. What problem does your business solve? Really think about that. You know, your product or service, what problem do you solve? And once you really identify like, well, my business, it solves this specific problem. Then, you know, like I need to sell it by all means necessary because I truly believe in and I truly believe I can solve a problem. So I hope this is helpful for y'all. Y'all have a great day.